Trip's awakening. My signal's going to keep glowing. Whenever it comes to the younglings, the young male soul, they, they look like the girl soul. You know, their physical bodies like transform into a female, you know, and the negative shadows basically conditioning, you know, your. That's the reason why you see, you know, the both, you know, male soul and female soul with the same haircut and, you know, everybody's basically wearing the same clothes. So that goes back to where I was telling y'all, you know, we're supposed to be nude, naked, you know, like you've been programmed to wear this and that, you know, and whenever it comes to the same sex, that's like, that's negative energy, you know, and negative energy, I, I really don't respect that. And, you know, you know, certain individuals, certain individuals be like, oh, I'm, you know, no disrespect to the gays and this and that. You know, I don't care what they do. That's their business. But that's, to me, that's negative energy. And there are certain beings that will sleep with anything and some of you earthlings then connected with that. And then whenever you're, uh, st your star seed or your youngling or young portal or, you know, young star uh, pop out of there, you know, like certain chemicals latch on to them, like negative energy latch on to them. So, you know, I like I said, I don't have nothing against anyone. Whatever y'all do, that's y'all's business. That ain't got nothing to do with me. But, you know, um, for example, um, Prince. Look at what he was wearing. And he was wearing women perfume and stuff. And it was and then, you know, of course Andre three thousand gonna try to copy off of Prince and it, it's they they been they been basically conditioning y'all on so many different levels. You know, they're basically trying to tell you who you really are, but you can't see who you are. You know, like so the women basically can create you know, the stars and the portals. And that's male and female. Transgenders, they create something totally different and something negative, and that was back then. Now y'all about to see certain things that's about to come out, a different type of breed. And some of y'all star seeds, you know, they're probably going to be on some other stuff, just to put that out there. Because some of y'all basically didn't match your frequency. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Uh, are you okay? Uh, <laughs> spiritually free. <laughs> My fault, y'all. Huh? She left her windows open. Oh. Uh, uh. Yeah, me neither. Uh, my apologies, y'all. Especially free room to step. <laughs> she kind of fell, but she all right, y'all. So, <laughs> uh, <laughs> but you know, um, basically, you know, like I said, there's going to be some, a lot of stuff come out, you know, and uh, certain individuals, y'all gonna see a lot of individuals telling on themselves, putting certain things out and telling on themselves. And um, like I said, I'm not exposing none of them. I just see the signs and symbols and certain things. And, you know, I warned certain individuals decades ago. Now, I'm here traveling and warning y'all, telling y'all what's going on. Y'all worried about what certain individuals are wearing and stuff. You know, and it doesn't matter what they wear. You know, there's a lot of same sex going on. There's a lot of things going on. They got y'all doing the hidden rituals and stuff. And y'all in competition with each other. Battle of the sexes. You know, some of y'all better be careful. 
just like I said, there are certain individuals look like females with both parts. And then you have a different type of another breed. They can basically shut down certain parts inside of your physical body because they got a certain fluid that's pumping through their physical body that's not supposed to match with y'all's and that's what's destroying y'all. Y'all connecting with something totally different. You're supposed to be on a high frequency. Y'all connecting with certain beings and stuff and then y'all worried about the material things and stuff. Y'all just programmed on so many different levels, you know, and then, you know, y'all, you know, say, oh, well, if this individual, you know, um, can't take care of me, like, for example, y'all, like I said before, y'all were basically, you know, down an individual or talk about them, you know, if their woman soul choose to take care of them. You know, y'all don't know the situation or vice versa. Y'all will probably say, you know, uh, the woman's soul is using that man because, you know, he owns a business. You know, nobody doesn't own anything. You just own your soul. Our DNA created these illusion skulls. You know, but you own your soul. You don't own none of this stuff because it's nothing but material things and y'all connected to that. And the money basically is to have y'all connected and latch your energy onto that because if it wasn't if it wasn't an illusion money on this realm, then it wouldn't be certain bloodlines, certain negative shadows couldn't survive in low frequency realms, and y'all don't see that. That's the reason why all of this mess was created, like religion. And, you know, um, different things. So certain individuals can survive. You know, y'all not worried about surviving. Y'all not worried about that, like surviving, connecting with your loved ones or, you know, talking about the weather. And I'm not talking about this illusion weather. You know, y'all not, y'all not, you know, you're not connecting with each other. It's like y'all more worried about the devices and the spirits and stuff that you wear and that you connect with. And like now, like I said, the same, like, I mean, the the male, and, male soul and woman soul, y'all all basically wearing the same thing, man, wearing wig, lipstick, and all of that stuff. You know, like I said, y'all wearing wigs and don't know that the wigs that you put on your head, male and female, you know, you're basically doing a ritual. You're, you're, you're buying hair like ritual. You were basically, you know, like the society groups where used to wear people's scalps on their heads and, you know, uh, drink different animal bloods and human blood and sick stuff. And they do sick things. Certain celebrities, like not not all celebrities, but majority of them, the high pro, or the so-called high-profile celebrities, you know, they do sick rituals. They record them doing certain things, then they will leak out the tape. They have them doing the same rituals if they don't expose certain individuals and stuff like that. And some of y'all don't see that, but y'all worried about what certain individual wear and stuff. You know, there's probably straight men that likes to wear girls' clothes. I mean, you know, and some of y'all say they gay, you know. Um, like Prince, you know, like, you know, I, don't, I don't know him. But, you know, he hung around with a bunch of women and he wore girl clothes. You know, the, the those that try to play tough and all of that rough stuff, they basically be the fruitcakes, you know, like, for real, like, I mean, and then, you know, I, I could get deep into that, but I'm not even getting into all of that. But, you know, um, the same sex, that's not, that's not, that's not cool at all. And I, I, I'm, I don't see what some of y'all get out of it. But like I said, it's certain things that y'all connect with, you know, like, and then that latches on and then you, you start acting like 
that uh, whatever you mess with, you start acting like that being. That's what I was putting out there. You start acting like that being. You know, y'all, y'all just messed up on so many different levels. And some of y'all, I'm not gonna say all of y'all. You know, y'all messed up. You know, so. But did somebody say something?